This is a quick tutorial on how to set up Chrome printing to be able to print from your Chromebook to a printer. In order to do this, you actually have to go to a desktop computer, not a Chromebook, to set this up. So I'm on my desktop. You're going to go to the More menu, which are the three vertical dots that you see right here in the top right-hand corner. Um, make sure that you are signed into Chrome as yourself. Click those three dots. Scroll down to Settings. Once you're in, right here, it's going to tell you if you are signed in or not, or if you need to sign in again just to verify yourself. So if it asks you to sign in, please do so right here. Once you've done that, scroll down to Show Advanced Settings. You're going to scroll down a little more until you see Google Cloud Print. You're going to click on Manage. Okay. And you're going to look for the device that you want to be able to print to. Um, I want to be able to print to this one. So I'm going to click on Manage. Okay. And now we're going to share it. Right here, if I am a teacher um, and I want to be able to cloud print myself or Chrome print, I'm going to actually have to type in my email down here make sure that it says can print and click share so even though it does say that I'm the owner already I do need to make sure that I still type in my email once I've clicked shared I click close if you're a teacher and you want to share this with your students this is where you will also type in their um, student emails right here and then click share as well okay if Chrome, if you try to print and it says your printer is offline, sometimes Chrome um, does have a glitch and it will kick you off. You may be able to still print from your desktop to that printer, but you may not be able to print from a Chromebook to that printer. If that is the case, you'll have to go back through these steps, click share again, and reshare the printer with yourself again. And after that, you should be able to print. If you're unsure, you can always look at show print jobs. Um, I don't have any right now, but it would if I had tried to print. It would tell me if they were waiting to print, if there was an error, if the printer was still offline, or if they did print. So you may have to repeat those steps if it does kick you off.